Hello, welcome to this video and today we will be covering how to install the Glass Clipper Genshin Impact Private Server. The requirements are simple. You need to install MongoDB Java 17 if you want to use the dev branch version of Grass Cutter. And that's really it. And also the bin output repository from GitHub. This one. Just join the grass cutters server to get this one. You will need Git to clone the repo. So first of all, this is how to install Git. Just download it. Choose Windows, download the binary, Windows setup, and you will be settled. Next, MongoDB. What you will want to install is MongoDB Database Community Edition because it's free. Just type your email. No, you don't need an email. Yes. Yeah, that's so. I because I downloaded MongoDB, I I don't need to install it anymore. But here's MongoDB. MongoDB Compass is the GUI for MongoDB, and and a prompt will will turn up after you have successfully installed MongoDB Community Server. It's quite it's quite like heavy in size so you might want to install it in another drive other than C yeah so this is MongoDB compass it will show show a like a checkbox to to ask you to install it or not so just check it it's the it's the GUI for viewing the database and just hit connect and it will show next you will want to clone the dev branch in today's video I will use the dev branch because it has more feature and and it doesn't contains so much bug so here we go so github grass cut dev branch this is dev branch you can just download the zip but i don't recommend that because like uh like when we when they have a new commit you can recompile it recompile the code and your server will be updated to the latest comment yeah so let's do this go to somewhere grass cutter i've already had one yeah so just launch command git clone branch development and copy the URL in, in your setup. It will clone the development branch. And here we are. Just remember that you will need to like delete the config.json file when when you first after you first clone the the repo because it contain the incorrect uh, star file you will need to change it into something else or just delete it and the server will like generate one for you yeah so next step is to clone the bin output it's it's contain grass to resources you can just like zip it the zip is more 
like shrink in size because it's compressed and in the results folder just drag all these folders into the like resources folder of this one yeah just drop it into this one and all of the bin file will go here next you you will want to install java i forgot to tell you how to install java so here it is i recommend like eclipse jdk because it's like open it's open source so adoption adoption tamarin you you can like download the zip and add add the bin folder into path but just for just for the ease let's just download the msi and install it and also remind remember that uh, during the installation you would want to like check the check the box uh what is it again yeah here it is yeah so you want to entire feature will be installed on local hard drive and just click next all the way and it's done and just remember that you should uninstall all other java installations before installation it's installing this because it might conflict with the other versions of java like java 8 to check the current version of java you you'd want to java version yeah so i'm using open jdk 64-bit server vm tamurin version 17 year here it's on uh, version is on uh, grass cutter yeah that's it and to compile the server what you want to do is and grab new jar and it will build the server from scratch for you but you would need to like fetch the if you want to like fetch it to the latest comment let's get check out this oh yeah uh oh it's git pull i forgot the command is git pull and it will update all related files and stuff and to include these in your server that jar you in grass cutter that jar server software you must uh like uh compile it again grand new jar no I have not typed incorrectly. Grab the jar. Yeah, so it's running from scratch. This is my install script, just ignore it. And this is the start command. You can just ignore it. Or can use it to i often start the server by using the command but if it's not easy for you you can use this to start your server and yeah so when you like use git pull 
the config.json might be changed so I don't know no, it will not be changed if it has been generated by the server before yeah this the it's the key start yeah key start password it should be one two six one two three four five six it's almost finished maybe it will take a little minute i will pause the video now so after about like two minutes and 17 seconds um the build has been successful now if you usually watch the devs uh like develop and write codes on the grass cutter discord you will notice that their compile time is much like shorter because they have they have a stronger computer I, i'm just using a laptop so mine is like doesn't very suit for development but suits you yeah so to launch it you just hit start command or wait it it doesn't run i forget it i will just run using java jar java jar press cutter that's it that's the command and it will be hosted to your local host oh so now i if you play on like English the English server if you want like the commands to be like have English like server notice or server messages just click enter or if you are in uh, other languages then uh, type the language code of your own I just I just use the default one for now yeah so that's it and now I'll show you how to join the server so just use uh, up. it's called grass cutter x yeah so Grass cutter X grass clipper yes. Grab. So this is a pretty neat launcher because it includes the proxy and you just need to point the just download this download the 7 zip file and extract it and you will be able to use it to run pretty, pretty much any well set up server so where is it again i i don't remember why i put it but it's, it should be around here no it's not there press uh, clipper right here there it is there it is so here it is just turn it up custom server this my custom server is public is by the Vietnamese community you can join it but you will need to join the discord to be able to create an account choose your game executable it's not the launcher it's the game do not select the launcher as do not point this to launch it point this to Genshin Impact that EXE it confirm take custom server and just launch and there will be two user account control window uh, 
will show up and click yes click yes for both user account control you know it's the window that will ask you for will ask you for the admin permission to access admin uh, privilege one one is for Genshin Impact it's mainly for the, the cheat engine and one is for the proxy server yeah to, so just hit launch and type your account name and any password any password because uh, the devs has not uh, implemented any like server any like authorization yet so just enter any password and it will work if you get a uh, 502 uh let me see error 52 there's a in the grass cutter that's a result for 502 up here the yeah this one this 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 is also this is the grasskeeper launcher without the x so it's the original one it's open source the grasskeeper x is not open source for security reasons but this one has got the result for your solution for your like 502 error if you do encounter it yeah so just don't don't use stable because it it will like it's it's less advanced and it doesn't contain many features such as, as many as uh, the development branch this is the error 4206 uh, uh, error that I have said before for ease you just we would just want to uh, delete the config JSON if you don't want to like complicated stuff just delete it and on launch it will like launch if it will rege regenerate one for you to stop to create an account account create type type any username and any uid yeah so i just create an account called hdde or lowercase with the uid 738 the the uid will be useful for for comments as, as gif and yeah and that's pretty much all we have to do to create and host a Genshin Impact grass cutter server if you have any question just join the discord server located in the readme it's right here For to support it, please join the Discord server. Just click that and join. Remember that this is like very technical, so if you only want to join a server, just find one and join. Because setting up a server requires a high technical skill and if you run into any errors and you don't have enough knowledge to fix it and and spam it like in this support channel then it it would be like very troublesome for many people yeah that's all so good luck with your server i will end my video here